Hello everyone, this is my new video. I'll show you how to prepare beef curry Indian style. This is rose. Here are the ingredients. The beef. Tomato, garlic, ginger, cilantro, uh, cumin seed, the cardamom seed, this is the cumin seed, cardamom seed, the uh, curry powder, salt, I preheat the oil, oil first, put now the cumin seed on the pew, and then let it fry a little bit. After this, I will put onion. The onion first, and then the tomato followed by the rest of the ingredients. It is still, let me stir for a little while. Now I put the onion, it's sizzling now. Let it brown a little bit. It is already smelling because of the cumin seed. While I'm stirring it, or you can just leave it like that. Just make sure that it will not be burned. Already add the tomato, the garlic, and the um, ginger. Actually, in Indian cooking, they used to use the um, the garlic paste together. I don't have that. I so I just want to use the pressed one. So I the pressed one means the pressed cutting of the the garlic and the ginger, and uh, let it brown a little bit the paste for a while and then I will add the turmeric and the curry powder and that's the uh, we are calling it we are doing the masala before putting the, the beef. I will put now the curry powder there's the curry powder and then the turmeric powder making the masala now add little water let it boil so it depends on your taste if you want more curry and turmeric This is called masala. Let it boil. Now I can add the beef. Stir it until the masala is all over the beer. looks like I'm marinating it so the taste of the masala will be deep inside the beef. While it is boiling a little bit. Cover it for a while and then later on I will add more water until 
the beef is already tender or became soft. Let us add um, the bay leaves and the four pieces of cumin seed to taste more. While still boiling, so later on I will add more water. Add pepper to taste. It all depends on you how spicy you want. Stir it a little bit. Mmm, smells good already. My daughter will tell me again, Mom, I cannot sleep because of the smell of the food. It's not cute, it's smelling, but probably the smell of this yummy, yummy food is entering the door of her bedroom. Now I will add more water and leave it for a while until the, the beef is soft. But I'm not uh, putting too much uh, the sauce. It tastes better when it is less sauce. But I use more water only for the purpose of letting the beef become soft. Okay, we'll leave it like that and then we'll go back after a few minutes. Once in a while, have a look at how tender or how soft is the beef already. Minutes later. Here it is, the beef curry is already cooked. Now I will put the cilantro on the top of it for more yummy and yummy yummy taste. Alright, hope you learned the cooking from me and I will cover it. It's already cooked, ready to serve. Look again, ready to serve. And for the complete ingredients, here it is. I prepared this list of ingredients. So if you are interested to cook the um, beef curry, you can, you know, now what are the ingredients. And by the way, instead of using green chili, I use the all other spices because green chili is really spicy and we are not that much used to that spicy one unlike my husband who was a native of india so since childhood they're eating and um, chili and spicy food and but by the way i noticed that when i started eating little spicy food it um helps uh, my uh, gums and my teeth and um, it my teeth and gums became healthy too so why don't you try a little bit spicy a spicy food instead of eating all those um sweet and you know the sweet food that uh, destroy our teeth okay now, now enjoy your cooking if you want to Okay guys, as usual, my advice, be kind to one another, always follow the golden rules, and thanks and praise God for all the blessings that you're receiving every day. God bless us all. See you next time. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.